We've got an update on a similar incident in Montgomery County. A judge has ruled a 17 year old boy accused of shooting another student with a ghost gun at Magruder High School will be tried as an adult. Our Nathan Baca has been following this case from the beginning. Nathan, I, I wonder how the victim's family is feeling about this. Well, Leslie, the family 16 year old DeAndre Thomas says the Magruder High School student was shot in the abdomen. They add he was in a coma for three weeks has had nine surgeries and has another major surgery schedule. A Montgomery County prosecutors say 17 year old fellow student Stephen Alston Jr. shot Thomas in a school restroom with a gun he built from parts. We talked to both prosecutors and defense about how they feel about the judge's decision. We are on the right road to accountability for the person who brought violence to a school. Um, we are working every day with community partners from all levels of government and police departments to try to make sure that our schools are safe places. Stephen is a young man who's never been in any trouble. Um, it was absolutely clear from the evidence presented uh, that he was the victim of uh, several assaults. Some people might call it bullying. If tried as a juvenile, the judge said Alston would only face a maximum of nine months mental health treatment. Now that he'll be tried as an adult on attempted first degree murder charges, Alston faces 15 to 25 years in prison. Leslie. Also, DeAndre Thomas's family declined to talk today, but you can see our exclusive extensive interview with this mother back in January, where she talks about her campaign to keep police officers on campus as part of this story on WSN.com. Yeah, Leslie. you anticipated the question I was going to ask you, Nathan. Thank you. And WUSA 9 will continue to follow this story for updates anytime. Make sure you've got our WUSA 9 app on your phone and check for new posts on WUSA 9.com.